know what I'm saying? I'm always with somebody who's, who's who's firmly behind, like, let's get some more female representation. So Yo, let's hold you. it down right now on the mic. We got VGBC Coney, former uh, grind champion, versus Lemon. Now, Lemon actually upsetting Pink Fresh to get to this point. Yes, I heard about that. Yeah. And Coney, on the other hand, been going crazy lately. Like you said, he won the grind not too long ago, did well at Glitch. This man, this man doing some stuff with the Inklings. Yeah, Coney's actually, like, the reason I, I entered today. I was like, you know what? <laughs> Hashtag not just a commentator. Man. I didn't Fact, get as far same. as him, obviously. <laughs> But I'm working on it, man. No doubt about it. Yeah, his we'll England, yeah, his England is definitely something special. I, I feel like England's just so good, but the results yes. for England, like on a national scale, just not quite there. And I'm really looking to see, forward to see if maybe uh, Genesis kind of change that. Maybe Coney will be the one, man. Right, Coney's gonna be the one to show us the way. And right now, Lemon trying to stop that from happening, though, throwing him off the stage, trying to stop this edge guard nice down air. Yeah, I really like this Mega Man too. Like, I don't know, man. Maybe it's just me, but like, I don't see enough Mega Man representation. You know what I'm saying? This character's yeah. actually nice. You know what I'm saying? Like, I see Plup playing all the time in streaming. Come to a tournament, bro. <laughs> yeah, tell him, man. Let Good your backers. man Lemon know. Oh, that was clean, Sam. That's Did exactly what Lemon's been doing this entire time. The last set we saw him do, just catching these backers when no one is expecting it. And an up tilt punish, jeez. Yeah, my man's got all the tools right now. Now, a little bit, I'm wondering if a little bit of matchup unfamiliarity will be a hindrance for Coney. Right. Obviously, Mega Man, not a character we see too often here in Xanadu, but Lemon really putting on for the whole damn Discord right now, bro. Oh, yeah. I've seen this man make it to Grand Finals and uh, back in Smash 4 multiple times up against Wadi, even taking sets off of him before. Real? Okay, so, let's go. Yeah, wow. It, he can definitely do it uh, if anyone can with Mega Man. All right, got that rich history. Right now, Coney is struggling. He's able to replenish that ink, but still not able to really punish him. Lemon just finding ways to get back using the buzzsaw to pressure a little bit, but opportunity for Coney trying to exploit those really dominant aerials that Inkland has, but nothing Ooh. going. Oh, my God. Lemon lining them up, man. Yeah, those backers, I'm telling you, he's so proficient with them. He catches too many. And going real low for that last one to take the stock. Uh, but now, still hanging on at 181. Back air is literally just getting lined up in the barber chair, man. Just clean <laughs> cut, man. But unfortunately, it ends up taking your whole head off. Man. Absolutely, man. A little bit more than just a little off the top. And getting the grab here, <laughs> fourth throw. At 187, or 181, excuse me. Well, man, Lemon, he is just not relinquishing the stock. And Coney almost seems like just getting a little frustrated. Like, man, I mean, how do I get this stock off? Yeah. You have to find the answer. Finally, okay. yeah, some solid pressure on the right side will enable him to get that first one, man. But he's trailing quite a bit. Right. That timing was super clean by him to get the down smash there. And these up bears, we saw ZD die to those so early. Got to play it just right to get out of it. That was such a nutty game one. Yes. I, was, I definitely <laughs> thought it was going to go the way of Lemon. <laughs> I did too, but man, like ZD flushing it out. Still found a way to get himself in the loser's top eight, and he's doing a heck of a job against Coney. I mean, Coney obviously very respected around these parts, but Lemon reminding people, I'm still that dude. Yeah, absolutely. Trying to get another back air right there and take him off. But Coney got to play it mm. safe. Ooh, trying to hit him with an up tilt. Going for it all right there. Yeah, I mean, he has, he has room. He has a little wiggle room to kind of, you know, play that strong pressure game that Mega Man can't put up at times. I mean, oh, was that an air? Oh, Wait. I think that was an air dodge. Oh, okay. <laughs> like, yeah, too uh, much ending lag on that for Coney to make the recovery. So, I mean, what a statement win. For sure. Winning it by two stocks. And an unfortunate SD, you know that's going to mess with your mental game just a little bit. Never want to give up a stock like that. But it does happen. It does happen. We'll see how my man Coney responds to that. Counterpicking the battlefield. Dude, I don't think I've ever seen Lemon smile. Uh... I think I've seen it once yeah, from mean, a distance. Right, I don't man. know. Maybe we can you know, hit that more. <laughs> you are not the father moment. You know what I'm saying? But <laughs> exactly. as far as in tournament, man, this boy about his business. I respect it. Yes, he's trying to play real serious. Maybe you got to get in that stoic, robotic mindset, and that's exactly what he's going for here, getting tuned with Mega Man. Got to hold it down, no doubt about it. So let's get it. Game number two. So Coney going to try and uh, add a few more platforms to the equation, see if that'll maybe help him out. It's really just a dominant performance from Lemon from start to finish. Yeah, the only thing that scares me, though, is these platforms plus up air. Mm. But uh, if Coney plays it just right like he's doing right now, he should be okay. Yeah, agreed. Got him inked up a little bit, trying to take advantage. TK sliding in the frame. All right. <laughs> yeah, he's able to get a couple of hits off of that, which, you know, with that ink on him, going to add even more damage. All right, kind of back into the corner, but going to use the limits for some pressure to push himself forwards. Since those do make you stutter, I mean, it completely messes up your game plan. Yeah, that's actually one of the things that really helped him get in on Coney in that first game. I mean, Coney's just not really able to kind of deal with that pressure early on. Right, and you saw ZD have the same problem, but he was able to adjust. Coney's going to have to do the same thing right now if he wants to make it happen. Yeah, guys, do it in this game, though. I mean, we're still in that situation where it's just best of threes. Right. So he doesn't have much time if he wants to make it happen. Good uh, percentages right now, though, for Coney. Yeah, not doing a bad job. And smart for him right there. Gets the toss right there, replenish the ink. Not trying to force the situation. You don't want to get caught. You don't want to get logic, man. You know what I'm saying? Get him in that situation where I can kill him. But I ain't got nothing to do it with. Yeah, exactly. No. Really good to make sure you have your resources on you. Keep your tank on full. Oh, my goodness. My man's going deep. Okay, we got the crash bomber on him, too. 
But now, knock to the left side. How are you going to recover? Yeah, Kony was getting those back are super clean, so smart on limit to roll in. All right, okay. once again. Yep, pressure in with the back air. I like it. I'm surprised he tried to challenge that with the forward air. I do get it, though. It is a disjointed move, so it might have been able to win out, but ris risky stuff. All right, dashes and rolls everywhere. Dude, are you kidding me? <laughs> I don't know how this guy he does is, it. He's so patient. I think that's just the key. Like, even when he's down a considerable amount, there's just no kind of frustration in his gameplay. He just kind of right. takes it one step at a time. And I feel like when you're just able to play like that, not like like clutch on the last stock, but like throughout every single exactly. stock. Like, that's what kind of would set you apart. And why was actually seeing him take a slight lead back from Kony, but only momentarily. Kony uh, bouncing back. Kind of a back and forth contest right now. This guy's playing a tight little neutral game. Yeah, Kony did a great job of getting the back air of his own to take the stock. Uh, but now, kind of working this neutral here. Roll onto stage and get the jab. I like that. Bombs in place. Able to get a little bit of ink on him. But somehow, Lemon comes up with a grab. Yeah, I kind of got the grab just off that explosion. Like, you know, yeah, for I like, like half a second, we were kind of blinded. And then all of a sudden, Lemon was just in control. Right, he didn't need to see anything. Just able to get that grab real quick. And now trying to pressure him with these tornadoes. Good grab. Just Keep follow him. Yeah, man, just keeping it real thorough. Okay, get the back air in there. And now coming down deep for the down air. Not able to get it, though. Gave up stage control, but didn't really take much of a punish for it. Now he has it right back. Yeah, you're going to see Kony just every single time. Like, if he gets him off stage, he's going to be real. Unless he has to replenish that ink, he's going to be real content with just going low and trying to abuse those aerials to take care of this stock. I mean, you got to make kind of big plays, I feel like, against this guy. Very true. Got to play it right to get Smart. back on stage. He's going to air dodge. Yeah, but luckily dodging that paintbrush. Not sure how. Such Kony, a huge hitbox, man. Kony wanted a lot off of that. He wanted everything. <laughs> I'm not going to lie, but as you said, that huge hitbox. I thought it really catch you off guard. Like, again, a solid back air. Trying to gatekeep, keep him off, but Lemon finding a way back in. My goodness. Not sure how he did it, man. Kony's putting out everything, but Lemon is just skating right by. Just barely fading everything to stay alive. Now, Mega Man, of course, does have the benefit. He's a pretty heavy body as well. Right. Don't let that size fool you. That man definitely eats his... Uh, whole ass dinner man, like myself. You know, so like a good meal, Sin. Like a good meal. <laughs> Fair enough, man. And a good back air right there, but he's just going to get knocked off the right side immediately after. Somehow still recovering. Kony's right in his face every time, but not able to get the stock. Yeah, that air dodge he gave up I thought was a little telegraph. I'm surprised Kony actually didn't punish it. May live to regret it or not, depending on who gets this first stock. And a oh. DBZ trade moment occurring as we have a one-stock game. That man really goes for these up tilts. He doesn't care how unsafe it is in the position he was in. He was going to go for it, and I guess it was right. He was up a lot of percent, so good on him to just take the stock, clean everything out, make it even. When you're about that life, man, that's just, that's just kind of how you roll. Yeah. <laughs> Very good up airs oh. right here, pressuring him. This is, this is rough right now. You let Lemon build a ton of momentum, uh -oh. and he is not taking his foot off the gas. Coney, this ink right now getting cleaned oh! up. Trapping this man completely. He hasn't been able to put his feet on the stage, and as soon as he does, eats an up tilt. What's going to be next for him? Trying to space out these forward airs just to get something. Ugh. Oh, that was so good. I love the fact that he recognized Kony whiffed on the hit, and he, he went aerial, right, but he didn't force right. it out 